Sean. Sean! What? Are you even going to talk to me tonight? Oh, sorry, babe. I didn't realize you were craving my attention. You're fierce moody. What's wrong with you? Nothing, but I'm just having a bit of a situation. What, are you pregnant again? Would you ever cop on for once in your life? Right, so, what is wrong with you? I told you, you just have to think. Right, so. Tony, man, I'm being serious. No, we got a problem. No, I need to meet up with you, come on. Yeah, okay, yeah. What is it? I don't think I should be sending it in school. Why? It just doesn't feel right. Well, I'm not going to make you do something that you don't feel right about, am I? That would make me a bad partner. Oh, thank God, I thought you were going to flip out or me? something. Me? Yeah, get off him, will you? And who are you, his boyfriend or something? Yeah, he wishes. Sean, shut up! I'll do you in a minute. If you know what's good to you, you'll leave. No, I think I'll stick around actually, this looks kind of fun. I can't tell if you're taking a piss, or you're really fucking stupid. Fuck yourself. Sean, shut up! Or what? Or else we're both in deep shit. Or else we're both in deep shit. You're such a nance like, will you man up? Sean, shut up, or I swear to God. Swear to God, what are you going to do? Are you going to hit me, are you? Both of you, shut up! Two minutes there, Wolverine. Wolverine. Tony, calm down. I am fucking calm.
Well then. I didn't know it would save me finding a place to bury you. Sorry, do you want to um, breathe any heavier there? It's just that I couldn't actually understand you the first time. Look at you like, you're a sweaty, ugly mess. Do you know who you look like actually? You Jackman, only like <laughs> fatter and uglier. But why are you looking over there? There's no McDonald's over there. I think you're tough, don't you? You've no idea. This world will chew you up, spit you out. It's not about how hard you can hit in this world. It's about how hard you're going to get hit and keep coming forward. See, that was good. That got me. That got me in there. <laughs> Look, Chubbs, I don't care about you. I don't care about that idiot down there either. I care about me. Yeah? I care about how I'm going to survive in this world, because after that, I don't care. Well, how's your surviving going for you today? Oh, fucking stupid. Don't have time for this. Stupid young fella. In the middle of fucking over. Now to top it all off. The fucking fat Wolverine. Fuck you. Get up. Fuck this shit. Fucking stupid. Don't lose. Wakey wakey boys, we're home. You used to work for me. You got involved. I don't need two employees. I need one. Only one person's leaving here with me. Either you decide it, or I'm gonna fucking decide it. One of you leave with me, one of you leave. So if I were you, I'd start it out. I'll be back in a few minutes. Don't puss out. Sean, what the fuck were you thinking? Now look what's after happening. Don't go blaming this on me, lad. You could have got me involved and we both could have been minted. But no, you had to fuck up like you always do. Well, don't act like you're so perfect. And what the fuck is that supposed to mean? Where do I start? You're the unwanted child of a crackhead and a skank. Great fucking combination. Your idea of a good time is getting wasted and beating people up. Well done. Well fucking done. Oscar for biggest dickhead goes to you, Jason. You're such a whiny little bitch. No wonder no one likes you. You do know that, don't you? That no one likes you. 
You're lucky to know me because I've saved you from so many beatings. Like, you're actually lucky to be in my presence. You're a worthless piece of shit. Well, shit, I better step the fuck back from you, lad. Sean McCarthy, the hardest boy going. You think you're a big tough man, don't you? But I know what you're really like. You're nothing but a softy. I bet you can't even think about your deepest thoughts. You wanna cry, don't you? Go on, cry! There's no tears, Jason. There's just pain. Pain and memories that I have to deal with for the rest of my life. You're never gonna understand it, like you say how tough you've had it. That's bullshit. Worst pain you've ever been through when you fell off your bike when you were six. And even then, mommy kissed it better. Who did I have, Jason? I had no one. And I'll never have anyone. And to be perfectly honest, I like it that way. Because everyone in this place already hates me, but they're looking for a reason to. So don't you say I'm weak. You're weak. You're worthless. As far as I'm concerned, you're better off dead than you are alive. Well, fuck you, Sean! What was that like? Fucking do it. If I wanted to do it, I would have done it already. If I did it to your friend, I've got bigger plans for you. My own, you know. Come home with me. I'll just do whatever the fuck I want you to do. Get in the car. No. Listen, fucking messing time is over. Look at your friend. Come on, get in the fucking car. Come on. Sick of your fucking bullshit. Come on, get in the car. I left that day with Tony. He said he had plans for me. It went on and on, but I didn't listen. I sat there in the car with my thoughts. I thought about Jason. He didn't deserve to die. It was all my fault. He was right. I am putting on an act and hiding who I am. Maybe if I wasn't so stubborn, he would still be alive. Then I thought about what I've done in my life, who I have hurt, who I will hurt. I'm better off being on my own. Everyone who knows me only gets hurt. I learned a valuable life lesson that day. Life's not about how hard of a hit you can give. It's about how many you can take. And still keep moving forward. I will keep moving forward. I know that there is more for me than this. I will make a life for myself. My name is Sean McCarthy. And this is only the beginning.